I love to hear like the best parts of bands getting together and making something real sick, you know? Yeah. I mean, it, it seemed like it just made the most sense uh, for us, you know, as the five, those five people at the time. And like, for us in the scene like that's the nice thing about having that kind of local scene where like honestly for the area where we live which is kind of the middle of nowhere there was just there was a lot going on there's a lot of people out there playing shows and like you know you kind of we we knew that like we knew that like jake and these guys were sick and like they knew that you know me and brody were like the real deal in our band so it was like kind of you know why not combine forces you know Mm -hmm. And, and and so it was like but beyond that, that we didn't really have much of an idea for the band. Like it was like, we know we wanted to just play like the sickest, craziest shit and like kind of just be weird and do whatever we want. But it, it took, it took a while, you know, there's some barriers to that, you know, there's just, uh, you know, it was hard to understand exactly what everybody's goals in the band were. So that's where, you know, member kind of member changes sort of started to crop up, you know, and then, but we end up where we are today. <laughs> nice. Sick, dude. So Jared, now that we're yeah. up to rivers, let's hear about you, dude. Uh, Brett from revocation called my brother and was like, this band needs a drummer. Do you or your brother want to fill in for him?" And found out that it was rivers. And Toby was like, well, I know you've, you've shown me this band and I know you're a fan of it. So you, why don't you do it? So I, I got in contact with Brody and he asked me to learn a couple songs. Um, and I wasn't doing anything at the time. I was literally just smoking weed and playing dark souls. So, uh, yeah. So I learned those two songs in 24 hours and then I sent Brody the video for both songs. Um, and he's like, yeah, if you want to do it, um, you'll fly over X date. And then, There's so many drummers that maybe even be listening to this right now to be like, oh, dude, this dude was just smoking weed and playing video games, and he got the gig, dude. (laughs) Well, yeah, so he he could come smoke weed and play video games with us. (laughs) Yeah, we got video games. We got weed. (laughs) But it's just like, obviously, you were in the fucking studio still ripping it out on the fucking skins, too. Yeah, yeah. I had my, you know, I had my drum set at home. Toby and I would practice all the time. Um I'd be, you know, like playing with other bands, filling in with other bands, filled in for like underlaying and stuff like that. That was pretty fun. Uh, yeah. So like I wasn't doing shit and mm-hmm. I was like put, trying to post videos and playing shows with flub and doing tours with flub. And, uh, yeah, Rob from Zenith passage and Brett from Revocation were the homies and put in a good word. So it worked out. As a drummer, guys, you guys all have like been hit up for gigs more than anybody. I obviously shows that that's just like the the lowest percentage of good musicians in death metal is the drummers because they need to be spread thin across so many bands, dude. So many bands are looking for a drummer. There's been so I mean, Gabe, dude, Joseph, Joseph's got a fucking massive list of fucking shit that he's done. It's like I guess death metal drummers are just i'm a uh, more rare i'm learning another set right now see look it's just like <laughs> it, it never stops dude yeah, yeah. It, it never stops with you guys and i wonder if it is just because it's so hard to be able to stop, beat, stop. beat drums like well, that it's, it's hard to find well it's also hard to find like you know a drummer for one but then a drummer that you're down like to like, tour with a real yeah human. that you're down to like yeah. sit in a fucking van for fucking you know months with so that's another double-edged sword there's a million guitar players there's a million i would say there's mostly guitar players and then there's some bass players and then it goes down to drummers and then vocalists probably there's probably plenty of those right like in death metal yeah Yeah, i guess so i mean you want to find someone just is there vocalists out there that have like a a a roster like a drummer i don't think so Mm -hmm. yeah that's probably true it's probably true so yeah, drummers are the, are the most workman like of, of, of all the musicians well they're the, lot of- the they're blessed because they <laughs> keep this shit going dude like yeah. if, if all of them just like fucking <laughs> raptured right now all the death metal drummers left the earth dude what the fuck would we do we'd go to fucking drummer from hell 
That's what yeah, we need drum kit from him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Then, it wouldn't be that honest. Bad. <laughs> if we're being honest, that's what you're listening to most of the time when you're listening to most totally metal agree. records today. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For real. <laughs>